Good afternoon, I'm Eric Franke with this Channel 3000.com news update for Tuesday, August 11th. President John F. Kennedy's sister Eunice Kennedy Shriver has died. She had suffered from a series of strokes in recent years and died this morning at Cape Cod Hospital in Hyannis. Eunice Shriver was credited with transforming America's view of the mentally disabled from institutionalized patients to friends, neighbors, and athletes. She founded the Special Olympics. Shriver's efforts were inspired by the struggles of her mentally disabled sister, Rosemary Eunice Shriver, 88 years old. Well, unemployed people in Wisconsin looking for help won't be able to get any on Friday. That's because the state's unemployment call centers will be closed as part of mandated furloughs. The closure, one of eight required furlough days all state workers must take this year. New claims can be filed and existing claims can be updated over the Internet. Claims can also be filed using the automated phone line. Some good news for the state's retirees. Retirement funds are up in the first half of the 2009 calendar year. They've gained about 2% over the first six months. In just the last three months, the fund has spiked 13% as the stock market makes gains overall. How However, compared to a year ago, the fund still 22% lower. Too early to know if recent gains will mean a higher pension check for state retirees. The president is in New Hampshire. Well, he'll host a town hall health care forum tonight. Lawmakers working to calm heated crowd concerned over the potentially big changes to health care. Some meetings have turned into shouting matches. Republicans argue that the meetings show widespread dissatisfaction with the president's proposal. One of four women accused of sexually assaulting a former lover says he was the predator. On the Today Show this morning, Therese Zeman said... There was no collaboration and no ringleader in an alleged assault at a motel southwest of Green Bay. Court documents say the four women, including the man's wife, tied up the man July 30th in a motel because he was romantically involved with all of them. Zeman accused of tying him up and using crazy glue to attach body parts on the victim. In sports, the Brewers open a series tonight at Miller Park with the Padres. Braden Looper, first pitch 705. High school football practices begin today all across the Badger State. And sources close to Michael Vick say he should sign on with an NFL team in the very near future. On Wall Street, a warning from an influential analyst hurts financial stocks. The Dow falls 97 points to 9241. NASDAQ down 23 to 1970. And this has been a Channel3000.com news update for Tuesday, August 11th.